The other day, folks, I received an email concerning this pillow, and they were asking my thoughts on it. And that's when I realized that I haven't done a review on this yet. This is the Teton Sports Camp Pillow. I've been testing this out for over two years now. These are so good, in fact, that I went out and purchased another one. So we have this one here, and we also have another for Susie. These camp pillows are very inexpensive, lightweight, somewhat bulky, it is what it is, but very inexpensive, good quality, comfortable. And in this episode, we're going over my review. And this review is going to include the pros and cons that I have concerning this product. If you purchase this pillow, this is what you're going to receive. You get the stuff sack, very simple. You have a draw pull at the top. You have a grab tab down at the bottom. And this is actually pretty nice. This makes it easy for you to pull the pillow out. This is the pillow itself. As far as the dimensions go, this is 18 inches long, 12 inches wide, and it's roughly three inches thick. And when it comes to the stored dimensions, you're looking at nine inches by seven inches by roughly four inches. And as far as the weight goes, again, this is very lightweight at 10 ounces. You can see here that the color combination is red and black with this pillow, but you could find this in other color combos, such as brown and red, there's a yellow and green, and there's also a gray and red. As far as the materials go, the outer shell is a 100% brushed flannel. And you can see here that you have the envelope style opening. This cover does come off, so you can wash it and you can also wash the pillow itself. As far as the fill on the inside of this pillow, this is a super loft elite four channel hollow fiber polyester. And this outer shell is what Teton Sports calls a P5 poly high count, whatever that is. Some sort of polyester fabric it's comfortable, it's actually quite nice. As far as the storage bag goes, it too is of a polyester. This is a taffeta material. Before moving to my review of this pillow, let's talk about price. At the time of filming, the retail price is $18. $18 for this pillow, that's not bad, and that's pro number one. The price of this pillow, in my opinion, is right. For what this offers, $18 makes a lot of sense. The next pro that I have for this pillow is comfort. This is a very comfortable pillow. Because of the shape, you can use this any way that you want to. On the shoulder, just like this. Maybe you're going to use it as a travel pillow. If you want to use this inside of a hammock, perfect behind the head. If you want to use it inside of a tent, again, it's perfect. Because of the shape here, because it's long, you can fold it. And that's what I like to do. I like to fold it, put it on the side, and sleep like this. I'm a side sleeper, and when it's folded, you have roughly six inches of cushion. And I find for myself, that's plenty. Now, of course, that's subjective. How comfortable this is, is a subjective topic. For myself, I love it. Some users may want more cushion. Some users may want a larger pillow. Again, comfort is very subjective. For myself, I find this pillow to be at a sweet spot, as far as size, weight, cushion, and so on. Again, for myself, it's a good fit. But will it be a good fit for you? That's up to you to decide. The next pro is the weight. At 10 ounces, this is very lightweight. And again, everyone, the overall dimensions and size of this is very good when you consider the weight and just how much cushion that you have here. The flannel material is very comfortable to have against your skin. Very, very comfortable. The next pro that I have for this is concerning the fill material. It's very compressible, and it does a great job staying compressed for a long period of time with no damage being done. It still lofts up just as it did when it was brand new, and it's been stored like this for two plus years, and yet it rebounds with no problems. Also, the fill material has done a good job of staying put for the most part. I can feel one spot right here where it's a little thin, where it's migrated elsewhere, but overall it's done a good job of staying put. Next folks, because of the shape of this pillow, you can use this for just about any sort of purpose. In a tent, in a hammock, in the car, in the back of your truck, your vehicle, and so on. This is a versatile pillow. I can't think of any situations where this is not going to be comfortable or suitable. Next everyone, this is a very quiet product. It's silent. When you're moving this around, it's not loud, it's not crinkly. It's a very quiet material that's not going to disturb you or anyone else. Additional pros that I have for this pillow include the fact that this comes with a lifetime warranty. So let's say that you do have an issue where you have the insulation migrating to a different spot, you don't feel like it's holding up, 
you can contact the company and I guarantee they're going to take care of you. Teton Sports is one of those companies who have a fantastic warranty. I've never heard of anyone contacting the company who didn't get help. And by the way, everyone, I purchased this myself. I'm not sponsored, I don't do that stuff. I'm here to share information, my insights, and that's that. Next, folks, this pillow is machine washable, which is nice. And lastly, folks, the storage bag is large enough to fit the pillow nice and easy. And with that being said, let's move over to the cons that I have for this pillow. Con number one is this. While this pillow is not heavy, it is bulky. You could get a stuff sack and compress it because the fill material does compress fairly well. As it is with the storage bag, it's a bulky item. And because of that, this is not something that I take with me on all backpacking trips. I have small air pillows. I mean, seriously, they're that big when they're compressed. It's very impressive. They're not as comfortable as this, but they're lower weight and take up less space inside of my backpack. This is, in my opinion, more of a luxury item, but luckily the weight is so good. As long as you have the space inside of your pack, I mean, you're in for a good night. Going back to comfort and size. As I mentioned before, these are subjective aspects, and I want you all to keep that in mind, especially if you're considering purchasing this product. For myself, this works well. It's a good balance of size, cushion, comfort, weight, all that stuff. But your taste may be different. You may want something that's larger. You may want something that's thicker, firmer. So consider your taste before purchasing this product. Consider the dimensions. Do you feel like this is going to work for you? And as far as the cons go, that's it. I don't have any others. The only real con that I have concerning this pillow is the fact that it's somewhat bulky. Is that a big deal? Only you can decide. Comment down below. So there you have it, everyone. Those are the pros and cons that I have for the Teton Sports Camp Pillow. All in all, I love this product. This is a fantastic pillow. It looks good, it's super comfortable, feels good against the skin. I love it. For the money, this is hard to beat. Again, it is a little bit bulky. This is not my first choice for ultralight backpacking trips, but if comfort is a priority, this is certainly a great option. This is something, as I mentioned before, that I've been testing out for over two years, and I've been using this primarily in my truck. Anytime that I go truck camping or I'm inside of Bento, which is my Japanese Land Cruiser, I take this with me and I stay super, super comfortable. If you've been with the channel for a while, you've seen me use this in a number of situations. Truck camps, van camps, in the Japanese Land Cruiser, in the rain, ice storms, snowstorms, and so on. Ultimately, I really do like this product. I think the price is very fair, especially for the quality and the comfort. It's held up very, very well. Ultimately, I like this product a lot and it gets my thumbs up. Now I wanna hear from you all. Comment down below, share your thoughts. What do you all think about this camp pillow? If you have one of these, share your experiences. Are they the same as mine? It's okay to think differently. If you have one of these and you don't like it, sound off in the comments. That's what this channel's all about. We don't have to agree on the same things. All I'm doing here is sharing my thoughts, my perspective. If you see things differently, that's okay. Anyways, everyone, I'm rambling now. Hit the like button before you go. I do appreciate it. If you want to support a channel that's agenda-free, YouTube, Patreon, you can join the Wolf Pack. Until next time, everyone, be well, take care, strength and honor.